Hey there, Saki here from Saki Tech and in today's video we're going to be talking about the Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Before we dive right in, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Saki Tech Online. So we now have an almost complete grip on the Note 8. We know its release date, we know what it looks like, and we know what the exact specs are going to be thanks to Evan Blast and his recent unloading of information after information. So let's dive in and talk about the release date, the design, the specs and pricing, which is basically the complete info on this phone. So as you may or may not know, the Note 8 is slated for release on August 23rd, meaning Samsung will hold their keynote and give us all the details about the phone, which is basically what we already know. And then it will go on sale probably sometime in early to mid September. So that's the release date. And now let's talk about the design. So here's what the smartphone will actually look like. Basically, it just looks like the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus, but it is slightly larger with thinner bezels and less rounded corners. The fingerprint sensor remains on the rear, but overall the smartphone looks absolutely stunning. So that's the design and let's move on to the specs. So here's all the expected specs that were obtained from a source who was briefed on the final version of the Note 8. And of course, this information was released by Evan Blass on VentureBeat.com. So the battery capacity is supposed to be 3300 milliamp hours, which is 200 milliamp hours less than the S8 Plus, but we'll see what happens. We are going to get a 6.3 inch Super AMOLED display with Quad HD Plus resolution, which is the same as the Galaxy S8 Plus, which is 1440 by 2960. The processor is going to be Snapdragon 835 processor or the Exynos 8890 processor. We're going to have 6 gigabytes of RAM, which is 2 gigs more than the S8. And we're going to have 64 gigabytes of internal storage and also a micro SD expansion slot. Other things we obviously have are the uh, wireless charging, the fast cable charging, IP68 grade water resistance. We are obviously going to get the S Pen, which unlocks a lot of functionality for that phone, which makes this phone superior to the S8 Plus. And then let's talk about the camera. So on the rear, we have a dual camera setup. Each of these cameras is going to be 12 megapixels. Both of them are going to be optical image stabilized. But one of the cameras is going to have a standard angle lens and it's going to have an aperture of f1.7. The other camera is going to have a telephoto lens with either two or three times zoom and it's going to have an aperture of f2.4. And then of course we have a front facing camera, it's going to be 8 megapixels, it's going to have an aperture of f1.7. And finally the approximate price tag, which is really hard to determine, in my opinion is going to be in the range of $900. If you do have any other sources that give out the price to be higher or lower, you can let me know in the comments down below. Alright, so that's basically everything we know about the Note 8 and that's most likely exactly what we will see on August 23rd. Hopefully, there will be some surprises left. So go ahead and drop your comments and your thoughts regarding the Note 8 and let me know if you're getting one or not. I am certainly getting one myself and it will replace my current daily driver which is a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. Now make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech and also follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Saki Tech Online. Guys, have a fantastic day.